I just want to say a huge thank you to Emmy DIY for giving me this YouTube um, video idea. The idea that she asked was, you should do more paper squishy DIYs. So that's what I will be doing in today's video. Today I will be showing you guys how to make a really common stack of pancakes with packaging. So yeah, um, and yeah, I have quite a lot of shout outs from all the people. They didn't just write done and stuff, but they did stick up for me and then also did make very good um, comments like thank you, like good video and stuff like that. So first one um, is a good thank you to my one of my best friends at school. Um, and I don't really know how to pronounce it, but here is how it looks. Sorry about my handwriting, it's really bad. But I want to say a huge thank you to Kids Life 123 ABC for commenting on almost all of my videos and subscribing. And after this video, I will subscribe back to you. Um, and then a also a big thank you to Avery Edwards for sticking up for me um, to a rude person, which your comment will be deleted. Um, not yours, Avery, but the other guys. And then Emmy DIY, huge thank you to you for commenting and being brave to tell me something. And then Baby Snowflake 10 just said good job, which is good enough for a shout out. So all of these people get shout outs. It's as simple as that. Just comment down below something nice. Comment down below done if you hit the notification bell. Even even say done when you subscribe to me and I will give you a shout out in my next video. And I do, I promise. So yeah, huge thank you to a bunch of those. But yeah, anyways, let's just get started with the video. Okay guys, so um, to make um, just, this is just really based on, um, this is just based on regular squishy. Um, this is just really just based like and this is this video is mainly based on packaging because I've already done a tutorial but I will show you guys how to make it squishy so let's go I have to move you guys here so you guys can kind of see a little bit better but the thing you'll need is paper to make this squishy you'll need like different kinds of markers to color the squishy we'll also need stuffing or cotton and I get my cotton out of this or stuffing however you want to say um, it just says give thanks and I actually use this as a pillow for my bed and I also use it because we got it at the 99 cent store and my mom bought it for me mainly for squishy paper. You will also need tape, scissors, um, one of the things that is very optional is packaging but um, it's just going to be a smiley face squishy because this video is mainly for paper squishy packaging so I use like these divider things and it just has an opening for packaging so you can use these two and then you also need more paper if you want um, just like a little background for yours which I'm not going to do that it's just going to be a plain one so yeah and also for the packaging you'll need your tape so stay tuned with the tape so yeah let's get on with the video and before I keep on going the video that I just recently post and some of the videos I haven't noticed until I watched them by myself um, I've been editing with iMovie myself and they have not been turning out the edits very good like the sound um, music has been super duper loud and just crazy so yeah and the voices is just really weird but I'm gonna try to not make the music as loud and not to try to do not as many edits but I still have to edit this video if it's, so it's entertaining for you guys but yeah well, let's get started with the video First you want to take your paper, you can have lined or you can have plain, and then you just want to fold it, fold it however you want. I recommend just folding it, like, isn't this called, yeah, hamburger style. And then since mine is just a plain smiley face, and you can also use a pencil, but just make it plain however, you really just can decorate it or really whatever, I'm just going to do a random circle. And then you can make whatever face you would like in it. I'm just going to put a little kawaii face in it. Comment down below some more tutorials that you guys would like to do. Because my, I really like my YouTube channel being a DIYs and like feeding videos and stuff. Oh yeah, and also guys, comment down below foods that you would like me to try out on feeding the baby lies and different foods you would like me. And then if you want to, you can leave the recipe down in the comments. So that would really help me. But yeah, so here's the squishy, so then you're just going to want to cut it out. Okay. 
guys, so I'm sure you guys know the deets. Just take every side except for one side on the top or on the bottom or on the side, and then just stuff it. So first, I'm going to take every side. Alright guys, so now that I've done that, again this is just a really uh, quick example, it's not really like a full on decorated. Alright guys, so I've taped up, um, so then just, just take some of like a potato and yeah, here's machine. a little hole that I left. Anybody agree? And then just stuff it until uh, it's as squishy as you would yeah, like. Yeah, sorry about my really bad nails. Flat, or you can make it really squishy bad. and squishy. You can put a tape really cover, although I'm not because it's going to be how you, you want your so squishy I can't tape cover, but yeah. Then for your packaging, you're just gonna want to take your packaging. Now this one. Oops, sorry. Sorry. Come on. Okay, you guys on the ground. So, oh. All right. Then what you're gonna want to do is put your squishy on it, and then you can just trace how you want it to be. And I recommend using. Alright, guys. So I like my squishiness. You can just like add them in, and then like squeeze the top, and then squish it and see squishy. how you like it. I like mine like this. So yeah, and then and, you just want to take what you do the top, that, which is um, basically the hardest part because it crinkles up on you like that. And, and, and then it I'll show you guys why I use the other hand to get some tape. Um, but I just kind of pinch it and then I put my hand like that. And then I just tape up the top like this and it just helps kind of down like that. Alright guys, so then once you do that, just open up the top or whichever size you want to open, and then just slide your squishy on the back. And then you can fold it over and tape it, which I'm going to do that, or you can just like, take the top and leave the opening space, but I like to keep it going, so. Alright guys, so that is how you make packaging for your squishy, um, and also how to make a paper squishy. Please keep on commenting down below, um, uh, the, um, details, what? Counting down ideas and more stuff like that. So, yeah. I think it's just squishy more for I think. So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please click like and subscribe. And in the comments below, give some food ideas with Kawaii Squishy Lover. One, two, three, four. Bye, guys. Once you do that, you